Hello, my name is Megan, and welcome back to Zoo Tycoon. Last episode, we built this moose exhibit, and then we um, fixed all the fencing. We upgraded it to the concrete fencing for the entire zoo, which isn't very big right now. We also threw in this monkey house, primate house, and I think what I want to do is add some monkeys around it. We could do... See, I wanted to do, we can do baboons, because they're savannah, and we can do, I think I want to do mandrels, because I don't think I've ever done them, and I really just don't feel like dealing with chimps or the long gorillas. However, what I, I was saying, like, we can do baboons here, but then we're kind of like making this, this outside edge savannah, and I don't really want to do that, I kind of want to mix it up more. So maybe, like I'm thinking, if, would it be weird if I put rainforest here and savannah over here? Like since we already have these kind of, I think my issue is, is that I started making these themed areas that could only really be in a rainforest, like this cafe and this, well, how about this? I'll get rid of some of these, and we'll put in some, we'll put in some savanna trees that kind of mix in with it. How about that? Let's do that. I'm going to put a palm tree over here. I'm going to get one of these just to keep it even. And then those, those look exactly the same. I'm going to put in some savanna trees. I don't really want those. I think that's so ugly. Um, this is the one I'm thinking now. It's not very big, unfortunately. Maybe... Get rid of that. Actually, that doesn't look too bad there. Where is it? I'm gonna put that in the corner. Kind of fills that up nicely. And then I'm gonna put. What did I just get rid of? I got rid of a foxtail palm. So we'll put that over here. And then. I don't wanna put another one of those. Do that yet. How about that? This kind, this side kind of seems bare. But we can throw in another one of those. And then I'll put in some savanna. Just a little bit, kind of just to mix it up, kind of. Spread it about. And then I'm gonna put the mandrels over here. Now they live in medium to large size groups. I like the elephant ear tree. And for monkeys, they're kind of big. They're, they're not as big as gorillas, but they're not small like chimps. And they're not small like baboons. And they like large. So I'm assuming, like other monkeys, they're gonna want mates specifically for for each of them, like they're each going to want to mate. And if they want to live in groups, I don't think they're going to be happy with just a male and a female. So I need to make it large enough to have four adults, and then they're probably going to have two babies each. Oh my god. So let's do one, two, three, four instead of three. And then I do like that. Let's, what, five? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. And then we'll have them come in on the side as well. 
we're doing the same thing now. I don't really want it to... What if I have it come out more? Wilma's given birth. That's what I'm gonna be thinking. Like, do I want it to come over here more? Then what the heck would I put over here? I don't like it when exhibits touch. I don't know why. I don't mind it in Zoo Tycoon 2, but I don't do it very much in Zoo Tycoon 1. Like, I don't like when they share a wall. But I'm thinking over here, if I make this glass, then I can kind of have, like, a split that goes down the middle. Like that. And then have another animal just on the other side of this. And then this can be like, well, I guess this would want to be smaller. And then this can be like a viewing area where you go in and you're surrounded. And I guess I could do mandrels over here. Chimps? I hate chimps. I think three is wide enough. But then it can't be even. It's gonna have to be four. Four looks way too big. Do I want to do that? Give mandrels more space? Give chimps less space? Look at how much space that is. Okay, no. Nope. We're gonna... We're gonna make it only three wide, and then I'm gonna do the thing where I give mandrels slightly more space. Okay. Let's turn this off for a second. And then we're just gonna go down and around. And I'm gonna have that covered too. Oops. I wish I could turn off the noise for that. It's driving me crazy. And that seems kind of big for chimps, so let's just do one, two, three. Two. Four, two, two, three. That might end up, it doesn't end up even, but I think that's fine. Okay. Alright, so we got two new exhibits. I wish I could put a door in between them. <laughs> okay. So let's move that up. We'll move that up as well. There's nothing to see here yet. You don't have to walk up here. Or should I do... I could do the mandrels here and then the baboons here. And you're kind of seeing rainforest and savannah. I like that idea better. Okay, let's figure out what mandrels want. Here comes my dog. He braved the stairs all by himself. My dog is nervous about a lot of things. The basement stairs is one of them. He's sniffing. I don't know if you can hear him sniff or not. Okay. The 
So they like elephant ear trees. Now I've heard that monkeys can climb out of exhibits using the trees. And I don't remember if I ever experienced it or if it's just something that I was afraid of as a kid. So I never put trees right next to it. But I'm thinking, what if I do that and then they escape into the other exhibit? Let's see if that happens. Because I'm kind of interested. I don't want any more trees than that. Come on now. Okay, that covers up some of that. Okay. And then, surprisingly, chimps and lowland gorillas like wood shelters. So I'm going to try it out with the mandrills as well. Let's get rid of this. Just hide that away back there and then we can put another tree in front of it. Maybe one of those. Hide it up a little bit. that's enough? I got no idea. I am going in blind here. Okay, let's just try it with two. Ugh. Oh, best zoo. Silver trophy. Too much rainforest, not enough grass. Okay. Do they want dirt? Or did anyone read? Yeah, so I'm gonna put some dirt under here. I'm gonna put some dirt under here. Whoa, too much, too much. Too much. More animals of the same type, see? And they're actually like that. Right. Oh, I forgot to put a giant rock. No, too many. No. Oh, look at him. He just jumps straight up into the air. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of this one. That's a lowly old balance and put it there. Then we need a mandrill keeper. So let's do... Mandrill. I thought he called Mandrill, right? Oh my god, look at the way he's moving. Yokes. And then we'll get an Olive Baboon Keeper. Just, there'll be someone there in a second. Alright, nice. I can fit all of it in there. And then... Large groups. They're smaller, though. More animals of the same type. Oh no! I gotta make it bigger. Okay. So their favorite is... Look at them run! Oh, that would be terrifying. Okay, so they like the baobab, baobab tree. So this is going to have to be bigger. It doesn't say it's too small. 
So let's put in... No, that's right in front of the area that people are looking at. They like the grass. See, when they when they run to the the side of the fence like that, it freaks me out. Too much savanna, not enough dirt. Kind of their walking area here. Oops, get out of here. And then just more rocks. Okay. I think we did fairly well. Do we want to put one of those in? They like it. Okay, but the issue is... The issue is they're gonna have a baby and then they're gonna... They're not gonna like it. I need to make it bigger. Did I assign that? Did I assign that guy? Absolutely not. What are you doing way over here? How did you even walk over here that fast? Come on now. Take care of your animals. Okay. Fruits and vegetables. Yeah, I gotta make it bigger. At least let's make it bigger by one. Not gonna do much. But it'll do something. Billy Jean has died of old age. See? They already had a baby. <sighs> they say they're well suited, but I don't buy it. You're just gonna you're just gonna merge. Alright. And then I'm gonna cover all of this with savanna, and then they're gonna want some more dirt, I'm assuming. Just one piece of dirt. It's fine. And then. I think I'm just gonna move this guy back. That kinda evens that up. Gonna move that up. One there. Do you want any more? Yeah, they do. They love it. One, two, one, two. Nope, too many, okay. So what is this? 88, whatever. And, do I have to change this? I do. Okay. Let's just drag this back out then. And then, let's finish this. Oh, look at all the people! How many do we have? 454, that's not bad. That is not too shabby. I wish they had one that was more rainforesty because I could use this for savanna and then I could use the stick pole. The poor moose is over here by all by himself. Oh man, they had a baby already that's all grown up. Michael, how are you doing? You're doing great. Okay.
And then, I think, I don't think I, do I want to do that? Yeah, let's do that. And then, these went here, I believe. Stop, stop that. Yeah, they go there. Okay, you gotta move. You got to move. I love... Goes there. You, you literally have to move. Okay. Let's get our flowers. So these are going to be red, these are going to be green, and then I guess I'll put some, I don't want to put benches in here, I'll put just a few, so people can sit and watch. Perfect instance for those? Who knows? I don't want those. I just don't like how there's that extra space there, but it's fine. Oh, you know what? I'll do this. I'll give them a little bit of extra walking room. Because they don't want to walk under the observation area. I don't know why you wouldn't, but... Oh my gosh, he looks dead! Look at him! Oh my gosh, what is he doing? <laughs> you know what I was just thinking about? I was watching these, like, fake animals climbing around in here. And you can actually see some from the back as well. Wait, where can you see it? Oh, from the side. Just kind of in these tiny little cages. I'm <laughs> like, these are the special ones that get their nice big exhibit. These are the loser ones that have to be stuck in tiny little cages. <laughs> Look, that is a straight up gorilla. Look how big that is. Look how tiny of a cage it's in. That is animal abuse. That is not funny. Okay. Well, we're already up to 251. We're in year three. Right smack in the middle of year three. We made 30 grand. How did we make 30 grand last month? Okay, I'm going over here so we can stop listening to the monkeys. Um, so we, you know, we, we got 36. Oh, it's just because we didn't build anything. Are we making 30 grand a month if I don't build anything? That's pretty impressive. Now, how much are we making just from this restaurant? From the gift shop, we're making four fifty one a month. From the cafe, we're making three grand a month. Nice. We've made ninety grand just in the it's been over twenty seven months, but still. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. I'm not quite sure how long it is at this point. And then I'm thinking another rainforest animal here. No, okay, I'm gonna do a savanna animal, a savanna animal, and then a rainforest animal. No, a rain savanna rainforest. Savanna. Savanna, savanna, rainforest. Okay. They've had another baby. And it still says they're fine. Alright, so we already have O animals and we already have M animals. And I am out of ideas for them. I don't know. And we have another mandrel? I don't remember them having a baby. They must really like these exhibits. It's only 89%. 
Does this look dumb? Hmm. That, it just looks like a little turd. Look how small it is. <laughs> Put a shadow under it and suddenly it's an animal. Doesn't it almost look like a little fetus baby? Well, now it doesn't because it's, it's standing and kind of has a tail, but no, it was sitting there. Man. All right. Enough distractions. I'm going to leave this episode here. As always, thank you guys for coming by and checking it out. If you have any suggestions, please lay them on me. Um, I think I might give up on the naming. Just because I'm not feeling it anymore. I think I spent a lot of time as a child going through a, a baby name book. <laughs> just giving my animals whole names. I think I'm going to give it up. Unless I get some, some suggestions otherwise. Um, but again, thanks so much for coming. Lay any suggestions on me down in the comments. And I hope you have a great day.